Hello. Welcome to the 2020 Plantidential Debate. Our two candidates, Becky and Reb, are in the running to take over the greenhouse, the Oval Office. Let's hear for the first time this year what they have to say. We have four questions and two minutes for each question. Hopefully this will go well. We have two polarizing candidates. Ladies, please respect each other and act like adults. First question. We are going to start with Becky. Becky, you have said that the experts are exaggerating the effects of spider mite infestation and the botanists are actually funded by alcohol and dish soap companies who are in cahoots with your opponent. Do you stand by this statement? You have two minutes. All right, all right, thank you. Thank you so much for that question. I have been waiting for that question. Yes, I believe that she is in cahoots with all of the chemical clown? companies, the alcohol company, the dish soap I company. That. I think she's in cahoots. That's cahoots just not true. With all of the companies that it's treat not these true. That's false. spider mites. Spider mites. It's been they are just little little tiny spiders that do no harm if you can even call them spiders. I think she just wants to... I, <laughs> yeah, I can't even believe that she's talking about these little cute bugs that, oh, it's like lice. All you have to do, really, red, if you red. get lice, when your kids get lice in school, all they really do is go take a shower and they're gone. It's no, they always make these big deals in school about, oh, my kid has lice. Everyone needs to stay home. They, that's so not true. You just go. You put on a hat, you go to school. And really, if another kid wears the hat, what's the big what, deal? Really? You're going to allow this? Oh, sorry. Gonna allow spider mites. Yeah. He's She's all over there with really? all of these spray bottles. <laughs> this is the sound. This is the <laughs> really? Oh, yeah, just knock it off. Just knock it off. You just... <laughs> all these sprays. You know she wouldn't be spraying, 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 spraying if there wasn't something coming back to her. She's getting something out of these companies. Kickbacks, kickbacks, probably from China, from Russia, from Vietnam, from all over the place. Kickbacks, kickbacks. She's like a cowboy. A cowboy. <laughs> really having okay. all of these fights. <laughs> quick draw, quick draw. <laughs> yeah. No, it's real. But you know it. Becky, you know it. Becky. The people know it. That is why Becky. this is a great country. Mm. Yeah, everyone knows it. Let's stay on topic. <laughs> Please stay on topic. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yes. Stay on top. Sorry. We need to, Very sorry. The, we need to... <laughs> yeah, this guy. Just, just shut up, man. Just shut up. Yeah, just girl. Calm, calm, girl. Calm. Brock told you to stay calm. Just stay calm. Yeah, next question. Stay calm. Reb, you have two minutes to respond. Let's please... Keep this respectful without interruption. Okay, thank you. If you'll give me that. Thank you. Spider mites are a real problem. They will damage your plants. They create these That's webs on your true. plants. Nope. You can see That's them, but true. it's hard to spot at first. Nope. And once you do, it's nope. a real risk <laughs> for just, you the to find them and dumbest for thing. your nope. whole plant collection. Okay. They that, will damage mm -hmm. everything. They'll spread from up. plant to plant. And <sighs> you are funded. You are funded. And the treatment you, of spider mites is not a conspiracy. Yep. It is not. <laughs> no, it is not. <laughs> You don't mix you. No. this woman. Sorry, it is okay. not a conspiracy. Okay. No, okay. It is I not a conspiracy. Nope. Would you mind helping me here? Thank you. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> 
It is not a conspiracy by any country, by any company. No one is in cahoots. You are absolutely in cahoots. You can make your own treatment for spider mites at home. You don't need to purchase it from any company. You can make your own treatment water, dish soap, alcohol, spray it on your plants, use a little brush. You can watch videos on YouTube. You can ask you know help. If you want you to ask me for question. help, you go ahead. With? You can contact who, who me on any social who media it? platforms. Who is it? Who is it? What I'm happy to. What company mm. is it? Hmm? Is it Captain Jack's? Is it Bonnet? No. Who is it then? Who is it? Who is it? Who are you in cahoots with? Who are you being paid <coughs> with? Can you help me, please? Thank you. Is it your dog being paid? <coughs> Will I get Who's that time back? Paid? Enough. Thank you. I am not in cahoots with anyone, and it is not a conspiracy. I'll stop interrupting. You when do you need spider mites. Smart. Oh my gosh! Are you are you hearing this? No. <clears throat> give a straight answer. You can't oh, even give a straight answer. Just shut up. Just shut up, man. Got an ugly dog. Just shut up, man. It's just not a conspiracy. That went well. Let's move on to the second question. Reb, you've been criticized for using what some call low rent lights on your plants rather than expensive grow lights from companies that specialize in plant growing systems. What do you say to this? Regarding lights, I believe in being a responsible global citizen. I believe that whenever we can, we should not only save money, but we should utilize Low the rent. most energy saving rent, resources like that we have. Of just like you, ghetto. <clears throat> grew up in the ghetto. <clears throat> I believe that dumbest. everyone should have dumbest. access to wonderful Woman plant lighting. You should have available. You should have availability. Poor, poor, <coughs> poor you should have availability Maybe to wonderful space. light at low cost. Maybe this doesn't have to be a hobby a for just the wealthy. Oh. Mm -hmm. This can be a hobby for everyone. And these lights, no, I'm not in cahoots with these lighting companies. These lights are not low rent. These lights are manufactured by American companies. These lights, you can get a pack of four for under $14. I believe these, these lights are even maybe $12. You can get them in hardware stores. You can get them on Amazon. They're energy efficient. They're a nice clean white color. Just enough. This is enough. This is absolutely. <laughs> Just shut up, man. Can you believe this guy? Gal. Sorry, gal. They provide a high Kelvin. They provide a beautiful white light. They are full spectrum. They're made by Philips. <clears throat> they are no, not low rent. They are efficient and high quality and intelligent. The environment is fine. Un <clears throat> I'm not gonna go I there. Know the environment is fine. Maybe I will, unlike some people. Smart. <clears throat> Becky, you have two minutes to respond. Okay, two minutes. <sighs> Thank you. <clears throat> <laughs> energy conservation energy conservation there is no problem with using more energy all using more energy does is light up the world and light up the economy we want to use more and more energy this using these little tiny spirally lights that's just ridiculous Ridiculous. We want the biggest, the brightest, the most expensive lights we can find because those have been proven 
by all of the environment, environ, environmental just, scientists just, to mm, provide it's, the it's, best light for it's your just plants. Not true. They've been that, proven mm. to grow the biggest, you say that about strongest, uh, rep, most wonderful rep, plants rep, for mm -hmm. all That's people nice. and all plants. In fact, mm -hmm. you can lay under those Sorry. plants and you can Sorry. get a nice, beautiful sun Sorry. kind of kissed glow on your plants. Mm. Yes, mm. it's true. Yes, it's true. It is so true. You, maybe you should use a little bit of those lights on your skin because you are pasty. Pasty people should not be in the office of the plant house. They shouldn't. Mm. They should not. Pasty people should not be in the office of the plant house. Plants appreciate their people <laughs> being... Okay. I'll stay on topic. I'll stay on topic. What? Oh, let me. Okay. What is it? Don't engage. Okay. Stay on topic. Don't engage. What's the answer again? Don't engage. Okay. Scientists agree that you have to have expensive, huge, fancy purple lights to grow plants stronger. It's proven. It's proven by all the best veterinarians. The, are you going to allow this? Are you really? <coughs> <coughs> the next question. Plant prices have been on the rise over the last several months. Auction bids are going through the roof on plants that are considered to be extra special, exotic, or rare. What are your thoughts? Reb. Let's keep this respectful. Plant prices? Yes, plant prices have been going through the roof and it's a shame. It's a real shame for the middle class and the low, lower income not as well off. They are challenged because there aren't as many jobs mm -hmm. as there were before. Mm. <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can I have that time back? Damn hippie. Can I have that time back? <clears throat> You're a damn hippie. That's what I said. You're a damn hippie. Can you? Oh, just okay. <sighs> yes. <sighs> Plants that were so once just, a pretty decent price are now going through the roof, and that's answer. fine. Some people, answer. if they really, really uh -huh. want a plant, they can go ahead and they can pay dog. that price. That is their choice. But Becky, other people you should have the Becky, opportunity Becky, to get you need all to stop dog. interrupting. Mm -hmm. Stop. Ridiculous. Please. No, Please not everyone has dogs. the opportunity <laughs> to buy all of the plants that some people do. Because some people pay tax. I didn't say anything. <clears throat> nope, no, nope, not gonna. I'm not gonna go there. 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 <clears throat> Can you believe this guy? <clears throat> no, I am not trying to just secure the LGBTQ vote. <clears throat> no, I'm not. No, I. It would be fine if I am, but I am not gay. Okay, I am gay. What does this have to do with plant know, prices? No, We're no, off to just vote. Just make sure that you vote. You can vote now. Can't even call her. You can vote now. You can vote by mail. You can vote absentee ballot. No, no one has stolen ballots. No one is mailing out ten ballots per person. No, they are not. It is false. It is false. It has been, it is not, it is. Can you believe this guy? It is. <clears throat> Just vote. Just go and vote. Okay? Vote. Becky, you have two minutes to respond. <sighs> yes, auction bids and plant prices are sky high because of this pandemic. <clears throat> Just like the psh, 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 sprays and the 
all of the things that are so important like spider mite treatment it's all a big hoax <clears throat> <coughs> The prices have gone through the roof. Yes, I am proud. I am proud of how expensive plants are getting. I think it's beautiful. I think it is beautiful. Only people are finally realizing that only the best and the most beautiful are perfect and acceptable for this that is not administration. We want only things that just the top few plant parents can get their hands on. Yeah. Don't engage. There will Don't be engage. no pathos. <laughs> there will be no <clears throat> philodendron. That it doesn't. Uh -uh. Not in this greenhouse. Mm -mm. They like to say all plants are equal. No, they aren't. No. They aren't. Just vote. They only Just say vote. That they vote. Can't you can vote them. now. Mm -hmm. You can vote now. Plants don't bring you joy unless they are <clears> expensive. <throat> so bring those prices. Promise up. not to interrupt. When a pothos costs seven hundred dollars. Sorry. Out oh, pothos. Right Two now, minutes. if a pothos is ten dollars, that is disgusting <laughs> for disgusting <laughs> people. <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting, despicable. Mm -hmm. Just tell them to shut up, yeah. man. I keep calling her I am. Last question. Thank God. If those with larger, fancier plants cut and shared theirs with plant parents with limited access to high-end plants, it would both increase their own plants growth and help those less fortunate to get access to the plants that could spread peace and joy. What are your thoughts, ladies? Reb? Thank you for that question. I, I do appreciate that question. So yes, I do believe that it would be wonderful and a great way to even the playing field across all economic barriers and levels in this country yeah, if this we could just share our plans this should be good. can you this hear me do i need to okay. put okay. my okay. mic inside my mask do i need do i need to clip my my microphone in my mask i want to make sure you can hear me but stay safe this is a dangerous time i want to make sure that we can reduce the number of deaths from this pandemic this is gonna work. I think I'm not. Right. You didn't make straight answer. You can't even give a straight answer. How are we gonna do uh -huh. this? You got an ugly dog. You got an ugly, ugly dog. You got two ugly dogs. You got one with three legs. Yeah. Well, he's got an ugly dog. He's got an ugly dog, and he's got one with three legs. He's I'll just got hold ridiculous my mask dogs. Out. Uh huh. Ridiculous. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm not the one Ladies. We'll just shield everybody like this. Okay. Well, can you repeat the question, please? Enough. Can you repeat the question, please? What was the question? Can those, oh yes, with larger faith. I do believe that if we take, if our upper class, those extremely fortunate people would cut their plants. They would I learn share my that stuff. their plants I share would not I only hard flourish, I share my but stuff. they would with feel you. better. Mm -hmm. And all of our classes and all of the people, maybe with less money and less, I was going to say academic, that's not the word. Less economic opportunities, probably because mm -hmm. of our mm -hmm. economic mm -hmm. crash. Yeah and just less access to the fancier plants and shared that wealth. I think we should have them cut their plants and share those cuttings with the people who are less fortunate. Then we can equal the playing field. Then those less fortunate people can go ahead and they can 
grow those plants up and they can Take use that Take to have beautiful rich. collections which will Take not only the boost their spirit give to the but it will give also the give the them the chance give to, to share the those okay. when they grow big and strong well, it's and they can stupid. <clears throat> all you want she she excuse me she she <clears throat> she 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 it's all about pronouns <clears throat> all she wants to do is take away Basically. take away from people who have all the good stuff and give it to all the people who have the crap stuff just i'm not even gonna bother yes, i'm not let oh just give, let her back <laughs> just vote <laughs> we just vote we need to get this clown this clown oh god <laughs> Final thoughts? Yes. Thank you. The main, main thing to remember, the plants are a wonderful, wonderful thing to have in your home. They bring you peace. They bring you joy. In these turbulent times in the world, they will bring you love and harm. I am not a hippie. I am a, they will bring, they are not just for hippies they are for all people they are not just for the wealthy they are not just for the poor plants can bring you peace and love and joy and they can just bring you a sense of calm they can keep you busy if you are staying home and staying safe during this pandemic <clears throat> plants should be for all people the most basic common plant can be the most beautiful, joyful plant in the world. You don't have to have expensive plants to be happy, to nurture them and care for them. Plants are for all people. You know, vote, vote. You can vote now. Vote to make this country wonderful and full of beautiful plants free of spider mites and clowns. Thank you so much. And thank you. Well, that went well. Thank you for joining us for the 2020 Plantidential Debate with Reb and Becky. I've been your moderator and it's been great. See you at the next one. <clears throat>